Hi guys, the frugal gal here. I have a small jewelry haul I wanted to share with you today that I purchased today. So first at the beginning of this video, I want to put these bracelets on here. I, um, if you've watched my last videos where I opened up that five pound box of Goodwill Blue Box jewelry that I accidentally bought, I bought by mistake. Um, I said I would show it at the end of the video, but then I forgot. I got 12 of these metal bra bangle bracelets. As you can see, one's purple, one's red, some gold tone, silver tone. Um, I said I would show them at the end of the video, and I forgot, like I said. So, uh, these are free to anybody who wants them. Some people do like these. Uh, they're not, they're just metal, you know, the, the bracelets. 12 of them, and you can have them for free if you leave a comment down below. You just pay shipping on them. It should be a couple bucks, maybe three bucks. There's 12 of them, so if anybody wants those, if nobody comments and wants them, they're going to end up getting thrown away. So, my um, haul for today, I have three brooches. You know I bought brooches. I bought this bracelet thinking it was Bakelite because in the store, the only way I had to test it was to rub it and get it really hot and smell it. And I thought I kind of smelt a sulfur smell coming off of it or formaldehyde, people say it smells like. I always say sulfur because I really don't know what formaldehyde. I ain't, I'm not standing around, you know, formaldehyde all the time. So I don't know what it smells like, but, um, really when you, I really shouldn't have bought it because I knew better because when you rub Bakelite, a smell is very distinct. I got it home. I tested it. It's not, but it is a pretty bracelet. It's just plastic, but isn't that pretty with the swirls? It's for sale. Wish I could wear it. There's no seams in it. That's why I thought it might be Bakelite too. No seams in it whatsoever. Really pretty. But okay, to the brooches. I got this brooch. It is a lion. And its eyes are painted red and it's got some red inside of its mouth. It's, it's a heavy weight. It's a pretty thick, nice, heavy uh, gold tone lion. Nothing wrong with it. Not signed. Now this is interesting. When I first looked at it this way, I thought hedgehog, right? No. I was looking at closer and closer. I don't know if I could get it to the certain spot that you guys need to see. If you look at it this way, it kind of looks, ugh, evil. But if you look at it up close, it's a horse's head. I don't know if you guys can tell. You can tell by the nose and then the mane of hair and then it's got the ears. Can you guys, I don't know if you guys can really tell on there. Wait a minute. I'm not showing it right. I know a lot of people like horses. But what's interesting about it is it's a scarf. I guess that's for, you can put it on a scarf, scarf holder, and it's a brooch. So, and it's hollow like that on the side. It's not marked. Anything you see on here is for sale. Just ask about it down in the comments. And then when I was getting ready to leave, I noticed this in the jewelry case. And the guy thought it was a fly. And I'm thinking, I'm not even correcting him. It's a bee. And you can tell by the wings. I didn't know. I thought, well, that looks like the Monet uh, butterfly brooch. And I've had that a couple times. Um, well, I didn't notice because I didn't have my... Oh, I always forget to bring my loop de with me. You see the stripes there where it's a bee like on the it's back. The, I got it home. And guess what? It's Monet, because Monet means money. It's Monet. It's the Monet. It's the Monet Bumblebee. Go look it up my book. That's for sale also. So that's my little jewelry haul for today. I still got this. I've got one of my lots that are still for sale. And I thought maybe oops, I moved it. I thought maybe it wouldn't sell because it's got that charming trolley watch in it. I know a lot of people don't like watches, but it's still for sale. All the rest of them sold. But I got this box in the mail yesterday. I have not opened it up. It is from Shop Goodwill. It is over two pounds. It is two pounds, not over. Two pounds of jewelry. I know there's a lot of cross necklaces in here. So I'm not going to open that. It's come, it came from Texas. Corpus Christi, Texas. I'm not going to open that until I sell some more jewelry. Can't do it. I got to limit myself. Got to. You live in a small space like me, you got to get rid to put more in. So remember, if you want these 12 metal bracelets, just tell me down in the comments. You just pay shipping on them. And I will talk to you guys later. Please go down there and give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. And comment all you want. I will answer questions. And I will be happy to talk to you.